Did you feel like you was in a war zone? Hell, that's what I'm rapping about. That's what motivated me. I went out. I went out to Chicago back in the day. Shout out to Brad, Big Brad. Shout out to um, my man Stokes. I was on 75th. I was like, yo, yo where the liquor store at? Uh, uh. And it was like, all right, yo, somebody gonna have a walk with you. His sister come outside. She got the joint with him. I'm like, so it just gave me, all right, whatever. So we walking. Walking out of Ave. It's the first time I ever seen this shit. Indicted blocks with the siren light yeah. on the like top. On the, on the, yeah. the whole shit looked like a war zone. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, what the f is this? What happened? What, 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 why, why they going like that? Nah, nah, it's gonna be like that all night. Mm -hmm. I'm like, damn, this looks like you in a war zone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You growing up in that. That's what I'm growing up in. Like literally every day. Like them cameras, it, it became a point where it's like we looking at it and it was for us too. But it became normal to us. So it's like it got to a point where looking at that camera, but it's still on this block and it's gonna shoot right under that camera. Right. Mm. Now mind you, these mm. can't it's not just a camera. It's a it's, it's, a, a, it's a, a light. siren oh. light. A uh, light, Word. not a camera. It's a light with a blue or red. Police, all night. Yeah, this the police looking at the CPD. And it's like right over, right over for blocks. Right I'm talking about for blocks. Get his, mic. Get his mic. Doing everything under this oh, light. Mic. Uh, Chicago oh, hold on. police. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, watch your phone. Your, your mic, your mic, mic just drop. Right. <laughs> not a bit. Getting too real. <laughs> <laughs> That shit bugged me out. Nah, Because I'm like, oh, with all this shit. But guess what? The shit you saying, the, the camera, I live 745 South Kingston, 7500. That same camera was right under it. So right. that's what you know. What By I the liquor store. store. It was but a I joint. Going on. Yeah, that's that's crazy. The house I was born, lived in it my whole life. That I same know. camera you saying was right on the same corner Point. that I grew up in my entire life. That shit is wild. Tap back in, tap back in. Boom. I gotta stop moving. <laughs> nah, nah, you got the nah, cord. Just watch the wire. Now, so just watch good. the wire. Tuck the tuck the wire into your pocket. Pocket, yeah. You be good money. Boom, boom. That way, I won't won't catch it again. But yeah, shout out to my man Stokes. Shout out to my man Brad. There's a lot of things I learned out in Chicago. Um, this is the first time I ever heard. Turn your turn your hat around. Yeah, yeah. First mm. time, I'm like, for what? What do that mean though in Chicago? Like, cause I was out there and I had I always wear my hat like this. You right. know what I'm saying? And the nigga, why? Asked, so is it because the style? It's a style, style in New York, yeah. like yeah. New York. It's New York shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So the nigga actually knew me. I didn't know the nigga. I went in the what's the pizza spot? Is it no? It's a chicken spot out there Harold's. in the South Side that everybody right. knows. Yeah. I went in there, I had my hat like this, you know, my New York shit. Nigga yeah. came there, he actually knew who I was. He got your shit to the left. So he was like, yo, I, I could tell you not from around here, bro, but this, you can't wear your hat like that yeah. in this neighborhood. So how you got your shit like to the left? Yeah. I mean, you under the five point stop. Right. If you got your shit to the right, I mean, you under the six point stop. Uh, mm -hmm. So them two different games. Right. <laughs> they told me like, you got to wear your shit to like, the front. Like, so listen, you. it's, it's two different yeah. sides, I would say. So listen. Uh, Black Stones, Vice Lords, mm -hmm. right. Four Corner Hustlers, shit like that, all under the five point stop. GDs, BDs, and Saint Disciples, all this mm -hmm. shit under the six point stop. Mm -hmm. So it's like, but right now, it ain't really like that, but back then, probably, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, left or right is, it, it symbolized something. Yeah. It automatically symbolized something. Yeah. Even if you want some cool shit, if you ain't ever been in the game, just the people you grew up around gonna mm -hmm. dictate if you wear your hat to the left or the right. Right. He was like, if I didn't know you or know of you, you know, I could have came in here and been on some other shit. You know what I mean? I was like, wow, yeah. that shit crazy. They really <laughs> on it like that? Yeah, 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 no, for yeah. sure. Facts. Nah, it's different. Chicago. Like when we was like, moving around, we had to get out of certain neighborhoods because my <laughs> man ain't know the shift captain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, Good, yo, nah, they about to flip shift. <laughs> like, I, I don't know the new homie, so we out of here. I'm like. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, like a white shirt. So what do you mean? Like, where the shift captain is like every eight to twelve hours, it's a certain yeah, white shirt. Like out the ship captain. Charge so every, yeah. If we got blue and whites, it's a white per, uh, white shirt. That's the, how you know who the ship captain. Mm -hmm. But they ship every. Yeah, we got that out here too. I mean, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. we got that out right. Here but it, 
I haven't. I'm, I'm still <laughs> haven't made it past the the lights. Sound like life. like you you. I'm thinking as a child growing up under that. There's some trauma that comes along Word. with that. Like, Nigga, yeah. I grew up in the in the crack era. We ain't had nothing like that. <laughs> the like, fuck was going on in Chicago? So and you like, wonder you because wonder they why. doing that off of shootings. It's not about no drugs or crack era. It's not. It's, mm. it's shootings, bro. Shootings, bro. Shootings. Oh no, they were shooting back then too, but we ain't had no. Sound. But that's like, what. That's know. how you know it's frequent shootings. Like I, yeah. I could tell you stories about me walking home with my little sister, and I'm ten years old. My sister. Four years old, we six years apart. And I'm walking out from school and some random shit and just like shots go off. Like a nigga shooting at a nigga at the gro- at the fucking liquor store and we walking 20 yards apart or 10 yards apart. Mm-hmm. And now we weren't a ducky, you know what I'm saying? Like shit like that. So they trying to, you know, they trying to piece all this shit together, but that's like, it don't got nothing to do with the cameras or nothing. It's just the frequent trauma. And they got to do with like, People not nipping that shit in the bud, bro. And yeah. by nipping the shit in the bud, I mean talking about it. The yeah. simple, the smallest thing is a conversation. Right. Could change so much. It don't mean you got to be on the block regulating like, no, nah, not this. This is a conversation to show a nigga like, damn, he thinking like that? Fuck it, I want to think like that too. They don't be having like saying. stop the violence rallies out there in Chicago. All the time. All the time. All the time. So God, why is it lit like bro, that? I, 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 I got all the time. It's, it's lit. Every Swear time I turn stress. around. Nigga, this two weeks ago, I was just at St. Sabina Church. I did a stop the violence speech at a rally. St. Sabina Church. I'm from St. Knife and Essence. This on 78th and Racine. This not nowhere near my hood. I'm uncomfortable there. I never been around there. I don't know nobody from there. Nothing. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? But it'll never get talked about unless a nigga say it. You feel me? Like, right. mm-hmm. I do peace rallies, walkings and shit in my school, but it's like at the end of the day, it's like, I ain't gonna talk about it. I ain't finna get on Instagram live and say, yeah, I did a peace rally. I was at St. Sabine the church. Cause I'm finna keep doing this shit. I don't even want nigga to clock my movements at that point. If you ain't on no positive shit on what I'm on, bro, you ain't even gonna know what I'm on. I'd rather they be talking about you doing those rallies than talking about your baby mother's argument. I How get come that. we can't discuss that? But they that? seeing it guess well, the same way my baby mama's arguing on Instagram. Mm-hmm. That shit on Instagram too. I got a page. Swerving through stress is my initiative. Everything is caught, everything 5013C, the whole nap. Mm-hmm. But it's like, I'm I'm really doing this shit for real in real life. You feel me? Like, so what, what I'm saying is I ain't even trying to say it for the interview. Like, bro, I really got in two of my day-to-day, my manager, all type of shit. I'm like, bro, y'all got me at St. Sabina talking out loud, doing this. This shit treacherous game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really got two of these niggas, bro. Right. I swear to God, bro, my whole day was thrown off. I'm calling everybody like, bro, they got me at St. Sabine. What the fuck I'm doing right now? For real, bro. Right. But I did it. This is for trap trapper turn smack rapper. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars I can hang with the backpackers. Trap star. Sleep, earth, you heard. Got your baby mama thirst, you heard. Feel the flow, nigga, throw it in reverse. This the way you need to serve, you heard.